Congratulations on purchasing the Flash Lube Electronic Valve Saver Kit. Flash Lube is recognised as one of the world's leading valve seat recession products, used and recommended by LPG CNG installers the world over. When using LPG or CNG, it is important to use only genuine flash lube valve saver fluid to give your engine that extra protection flash lube delivers. This flash lube electronic valve saver kit is suitable for LPG and CNG vehicles and contains all the components required to install the kit to your vehicle. To begin installation of the flash lube electronic kit, Find a suitable position in the engine bay away from areas of extreme heat, ensuring the reservoir is mounted no higher than the lubricant inlet port into the engine to eliminate the possibility of siphoning. Mount the cradle by using the two self-tapping screws. Position the bottle in the bracket. Clip the latch around the bottle accordingly. Do not fill the bottle at this stage. Locate a suitable position within 300 millimeters of bottle and mount electronic control unit, ECU. Now, plug in pump from ECU to bottle. Then, plug in low level warning indicator into ECU loom. Connect the black wire to earth. Connect the white wire to the switching side of the LPG injector. Check both sides of the injector with a test lamp. One side of the injector will be switching on and off during engine cranking. Connect the white wire to this side. Connect the red wire to a suitable ignition source so that power is supplied only when the ignition is switched on. Find a suitable location to install the low-level warning LED on the dash. Drill a 7mm diameter hole. Insert the LED into the dash. Clean the dash surface and place the flash lube sticker on the dry surface over the front of the LED. Feed connecting wire back through the firewall. Connect green from the LED to green on the loom. And connect yellow from the LED to yellow. For maximum performance, the inlet port for the flash loop system should be between the butterfly valve and the inlet manifold. 50 to 100 millimetres away from the butterfly valve towards the inlet manifold should provide good mixing with the air fuel stream. Drill a 3.6 millimetre hole and insert the self-tapping connector. Please note that a suitable sealant should be applied to the threaded connector to eliminate any vacuum leaks. Then, run the oil feeder hose from the bottle to the connector. Connect the supplied clip to hold the hose in place. Now, before filling the bottle, check that the LED is working OK. Turn the ignition on and wait for the LED light to come on. Fill the reservoir with 400 mils of flash lube valve saver fluid. Ensure you do not overfill, then replace the filler cap. Check the warning light has gone off. The dose rates are preset based on the vehicle engine horsepower or kilowatt rating. Adjust the dial to the required setting using the chart on the screen. For example, if your vehicle engine is a 135 kilowatt engine, adjust the dial setting to number 4. Concentrate on getting a minimum ratio of 1 milliliter of valve saver fluid per 1 liter of fuel. The easiest way to do this is when you top up your fuel tank. Take note of how many liters you've put in. Then check the valve saver fluid reservoir to see how many milliliters of fluid has been used. The figure should be the same. That is, if you've put in 50 liters of fuel, you should have used a minimum of 50 mils of valve saver fluid. If you're not using the correct ratio, adjust the ECU dial up for more fluid or down for less fluid by one point. For more information about FlashLube products, visit flashlube.com.